it's April. The Simple Scrapbooker. Back to do another page. Today I have this picture of my family. We just went on a trip to Las Vegas. So I want to put it on a simple page. So let's get started. So first I used the storybook cartridge with my Cricut. And I cut out this little shadow in the green and it ended up looking like huh, this but you don't have to use a Cricut so what I'm going to do for the rest of the page is I'm going to use my creative memories cutting system so I'm going to use my creative memories cutting system and I'm going to use this shape to cut out some sparkly orange background flowers to go behind the green. Because I want the closest cut to the edge as possible to get the bigger flower on the inside, I'm going to use my red blade. Just fit the little stems into the groove. Just hold the shape in place. Just run along the grooves. And there's my shape. So I've cut out four orange shapes. And the green fits on the orange. So now I'm going to crop my picture. I've decided I really don't want any of the white edge on the picture, so I'm going to crop it off. <clears throat> so I've gotten rid of all the white. The first thing I want to do is attach my picture to the middle of the page. And I'm just going to guess. as to where the middle of the page is. Now, I'm going to use glue dots to attach my flowers to the glitter because it's hard to get things sometimes to stick to the glitter. And this is the glue dot runner. Um, actually works pretty well. Probably don't need four, but that's okay. So I've cut them all out. I've strategically placed them. Okay, so I'm going to use my crocodile tool. And I've moved this lever to, this is front, to the second slot. I'm going to place my shape where I want it to be on the page and I'm going to go to the second hole and punch and here I have a hole. Take my little brad. The second hole is almost too big but It'll work. And spread out my bread. And there is my flower. All right, so I have my page. I've attached all my shapes to the edge with the breads. 
and I found these creative memory stickers and I'm going to put a sticker on each shape. These are from the zoo pack. They're probably fairly old. But since this was the secret garden in Las Vegas at the Mirage, there were lions and tigers. And then I'll put the little cubs across from each other. And I've got some little footprints that I'll use to finish off the page. So there we go. Have a great day.